Hi. Hey, Daryl. <laughs> How you doing? Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. What? Access granted oh, to oops. leave? Sorry, little brother. I thought you were a rabid squirrel. Knock it off, crazy. <laughs> I already went to the abandoned mine. Did I go to the abandoned mine too early? I did. I was pulled off course by my lust for treasure. Oh wait, is there more treasure? Yeah. I do appreciate having cash. I'm telling mom you threw a rock at me. It was a pine cone, you baby. Ow! That was a rock. <laughs> I'm a psychic and ten. Surprising number of flamingos in that load screen. Also, the load screens are so fast. The questionable area. Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through here all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that if you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> Ow! Questionable area map available? Question mark? Very questionable. Lots of questions. The Lumberstack Diner. Come on down to the Lumberstack Diner. Welcome to the questionable area? I hear rock and roll music. Oh. This is Morris Martinez, and you're listening to KLOB. We probe the mother load. Oh man, this kid is getting down. <laughs> Rules? What? If you want to be a spy so bad, why not start spying on your family over in the campgrounds? That doesn't make sense. I have to not burn the forest down real quick and see what this squirrel's looking at. Nope, run away from me. Rawr. It's a cyclops. It's a one-eyed yeti. Is there a real yeti in here? Treasure, of course, I'll take the treasure. Sasclops, oh, it's the Sasclops versus Nessie. Who would win? Sasclops, claws, opposable thumbs, psychic powers, single eye gives focus. Nessie, larger, swims, big teeth, more established fan base. I'm getting close to the maximum amount of money I can hold again. Love to see that. Time to increase the amount of money I can hold again. Oh, another mysterious cave that might have cash in it though. What if the cave has cash in it and the cash doesn't know if I love it yet or not? Oh, we found the family circus. I forgive you. What? Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh. uh what matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one glowing upside down? It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two! The Devil's Fire Hose! Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Queepy, on the bottom. Queepy has some core strength for being five. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. Got him. Now, Rasputin, up top you go. Uh-oh. Oh, cretin. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, ow. This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the Aquatodome. I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Booty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. If there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. Found the family camp. Also, I'm pretty sure the Devil's Fire Hose is illegal in most states. Oh! Oh, right. Compton needs a bee from the Forgetful Forest. I gotta hand it to the Aquatos. Pretty skilled. No. Hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? Yes. I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. 
<sighs> okay, okay. Okay, that's right. I'm gonna get a slow time spell. I mean, at this point, we've seen a giant fan spinning super fast and a water wheel spinning super fast. Definitely gonna get a slow time spell. I guess while I'm out here in the woods, I should try to find that bee. Wait, what are you doing here, intern? Hanging out with my dad, intern. What's going on here? What? Why are you hanging out with my dad, Norma? I think we have a lot to learn from our elders, Rasputin. I like this girl, Rasputin. Oh, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. There's only one of two things possibly happening here. One, she's trying to ingratiate herself in with my dad to get dirt on me. And actually, I think that's it. Treasure, I'm looking for treasure. What's up, little psychic giraffe? <clears throat> deer. <laughs> it's a short, it's a very short giraffe or a deer. Priority number one, I must spend my money before I find money that I can't pick up. This has become alpha priority. All right, back to the playground. What's up, Autobahn? Take me to the hub, please. Sell me something that I can use to get more money. Sifold wallet, the astral wallet. That's how I hold more money. Okay, well, I definitely want that. But first, can I buy the pin that gets me more money? I have enough money. Why can't I buy double Citanium? Required rank 52. Oh, there's a level restriction. I'm gonna buy pet animals. The astral wallet. Hoard more Citanium than you could ever spend with this celestial satchel. Psy roller. I can now hold 5,000 United States Psy ducats. So, okay, I'm gonna get Nick a brain. As a Nick, I feel like I'm pretty obligated to get Nick a brain. And now that I'm back here anyway. Animals always in the loading screens, I'm noticing. Otto's lab, how conveniently located and labeled. The labeling is what I really appreciate. <laughs> Almost shorted that one. Guess I should probably walk in like a like a person, not like an acrobat. A lot going on here. Scanning for thinker print. I'm the leader of the psychonauts. Access granted. <laughs> nice to see you again, Rasputin. And you've managed to stay clothed. Very good. <sighs> wow. Look at all these gadgets. Rasputin, I thought you would recognize these for what they are. Art? These are dreams. Oh. Uh -huh. Where do you think machines come from? They spring forth from the human imagination. They are human thought made real. Incredible. Glad you like them. You know, I'm not supposed to check out equipment to interns. But if you'd like to try one out, just let me know. I need a rental brain. Got any cool devices to lend out? Shh. Interns aren't allowed to check out my devices. But if you were to take your time, say, delivering one of these to Sasha or Mia, well, that would be none of my business. This one is a thought tuner. Use it to find stray thoughts floating around the world. And this psi enhanced camera is for creating photographic memories. I'd train you how to use them, but uh, that would only increase my legal liability. Have fun. Otto has loaned Raz some gadgets. Thanks for delivering those items to Sasha and Mia. Well, I... <laughs> Otto lets you get back to work. Very, very uh, humorous. Nailed it. Yep. Wait, I need your brain frame. Uh, Otto, did you know that your floor is on the lightning version of fire? What do we got here? Approved hazing rituals for new agents. Uh, uh, some things never change, I guess. So it is hazing. We're not even pretending anymore. How do I access the brain frame? I need a loner brain for my mentor. Here we go. So many brains. All voluntarily donated upon death. These people are all dead? Uh, their bodies are. And their brains are no longer capable of thought but I've preserved them here, in the brain frame. The mind is the final frontier of humanity. We've only begun to explore its mysteries. That is, after all, the true mission of the psychonauts. Someday, my brain will live here, and yours too. What? Should have read that NDA more carefully. <laughs> no, Otto, that's space. <laughs> How many final frontiers do we get as humanity? Because there's like bottom of the ocean, space, the mind. Uh, that's already three, so that's good enough. Just a lot of frontiers to make moves on. Hall of brains, unprocessed minds. Evaluate unprocessed minds for assignment and dispersal. Browse currently active brains experiments. 
Oh, it's a lot. It's a lot in here. Well, let's see what... This is A through AM. Oh my goodness. Cause of death, blacksmithing. Codename, Panini Press. Why'd they even save this? Smoothie blender. Are these... Oh, are these Kickstarter backers? Abby Normal. Cause of death, movie reference. <laughs> hey, this one looks not bad. Not bad at all. Heptadome Harry. Cause of death, abandonment? Found in the Heptadome. Does, do I need to clear this with auto? Is this gonna fit in my backpack? It's been a long time since you've had a visitor. We hope you don't mind poppins. Gogglore. Maybe I'm too late. There doesn't seem to be any life left here. Oh, hello. Can you hear me? My name is Raz. Who are you? Oh, you! Sorry, I just haven't talked in such a long time. Oh my gosh, is that my voice? Is that what I sound like? What do you sound like? Oh my gosh, who are you? Are you not me? My name is Raz. Words. Words. You're saying words to me? <laughs> what was that non-word sound I just made? Am I dying? No, not dying. I feel alive. Very alive. Who are you? Who am I? Am I anything? Am I everything? Am I God? Oh, I'm not sure, but I feel like I might be God. Or the universe. Or the ultimate cosmic oneness. Or something in that jam. Am I right? Well, basically right now, you're kind of a brain in a jar. Huh? But if you can remember your name, we might be able to find out what happened to your body. I can't remember much of anything. Hmm. I believe you are suffering from extreme sensory deprivation. Years with no physical input has caused your memory and identity complexes to atrophy. Oh, I am not ready for words that big yet. I happen to know of a body that needs a brain right now to keep it out of trouble. If I were to place you in that body, you would start to receive fresh sensory input, which could trigger some of your lost memories. Let's do it! Wait, what's a body? Aren't we all one? I'll be right back. What? <laughs> Where can you go? This is everything. I promise to be quick. While I'm gone, you try to remember stuff. Okay, but please hurry. I'll try to remember when I created the universe. Or when I destroyed it. If I put this brain into Nick's body, I think I'd be helping them both out. As well as helping me to get into the mail clerk's private office. Come with me, handsome. Can it be? Back to the mail room to put it in Nick's head. Okay, well this is going great. Well that went great. Rebrain Nick, absolutely. If I had a nickel. 